With associative arrays, an interesting problem arises. If we wanted to replace a couple of these larger shrubs in the array with a smaller species, I could simply erase them, but I don't want to because I want to keep this a complete associative array. So what I have to do is click on the associative array, come up here to the ribbon and use the replace item control. Now what I do is select the item that I want to put into the array, finalize my selection, select the insertion point for the replacement item. Now I go into the array and I touch on the elements that I want to be replaced with this smaller species shrub. As you'll see here, it maps the insertion points correctly and replaces the items within the array. All there is to it, we're done. Now, if I wanted to go back in and reset the array to its original parameters, it would put everything back to the original members, just like the replacement had never occurred. So it's really straightforward to use item replacement it's just a little bit different than it's been with non-associative arrays. So once you try it, you'll get comfortable with it.